What's up everybody, hope you're all doing great. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto and to this video uh, in which I wanted to do a quick price prediction and price analysis on Cadena. Uh, because I saw that it was relatively uh, bullish today, it's up 34%, volume is up by 100% as well, up to 100 million right now, um, which was necessary because I think the volume of Cadena in the last months was actually quite low. As you can see it was just ranging here between like 23 million and, and 90 million which is not that much for such a high market cap coin and obviously it, it used to be more because in the last uh, seven days Cadena has still lost about a nine percent okay so that's less than other cryptos I, I didn't even realize that Cadena was holding on that strong I do still remember like uh, the first time I analyzed Cadena was I think seven months ago then it was at six dollars so that was before the huge uh, rise in price we had right here so it was quite early with it i, I think i did the first analysis uh, around this period of time maybe um so and, and then already you could see that there's a very strong community behind it of people who really think cadena, uh, cadena is going to be it uh, so maybe that's one of the reasons why we are holding on this well like oh wow mana is very strong as well Mm. it's great to see to be honest um but yeah so what we did today with these bullish moves <clears throat> you can see that we've already dropped down yesterday was actually a huge day uh yesterday yesterday we went up by <clears throat> went up by a 40 percent in one day today we also went up but we took a break retest here of, of uh, 3.5 dollars uh, which is within this bigger area between uh, 3.75 and, and 3.35 dollars uh, and what i think is going to happen right now is i think we're going to drop down to this level here uh, at around 2.6 again take a break retest off of that and i think we can actually reach higher than than what we did so we reached 3.45 i think we can actually reach this level here at 3.7 i don't think we'll be able to break that uh, bigger key area which um it's not nice but as i said Cadena is holding on pretty pretty well and uh, at, at, at least if you compare it with the last couple of weeks and if you compare it with other other cryptos I mean obviously Cadena had already been in a downtrend since uh, the beginning of November where a lot of other cryptos uh, were still bullish uh, in November I still remember at least uh, and then the 4th of December obviously that big bearish drop and then to be quite honest with you Compared with other cryptos, uh, Cadena, Cadena has fallen quite a bit over the last half year. Um, so that it has fallen less in the last week doesn't say that much over the bigger picture. Still, uh, it's good to stay positive. So over the short term, I, I do expect some bullish moves again after a, a small drop down to that 2.5 level again. 2.5 level obviously also being a, a major psychological support level. And I think we can consolidate up here between uh, 3.7, as I said, and 2.5 for a couple of days. But after that, I do expect us to uh, drop down again, not this far. I don't know why I did that, but at least down to $2. And I think now that uh, $2 can actually hold on a little bit stronger, uh, but I do have to analyze uh, analyze Cadena again when we actually do hit that level, just to see what kind of touch we got. Um, and what that means for for like the for like the future um, but yeah I don't think we're going to drop down to this 1.5 level uh, with that next bearish impulse I do expect but two dollars is also a psychological support level uh, we do have some some other uh, support and uh, support levels around that and a FIP level so pretty strong I think that's going to hold but uh, as I said I will have to update it as well um, so yeah, that's basically my analysis on Cadena or KDA uh, for now. If you do have any questions about the analysis or anything I said uh, within a video, please let me know down in the comments and I'll make sure to respond to that as soon as possible. As for now though, thank you all for watching and listening and I hope to see you all in my next videos. Bye.